Hey YouTube, what's going on? I figured out how to do something pretty cool on Reason and I thought I would show you how I do it just so you could do it too in case you wanted to. Uh, let me show you the gear that I'm using here. For my controller I'm using my wonderful Yamaha M06 which I like a lot which has a lot of cool sounds on its own. You don't even need Reason with this but I like Reason. And of course I'm using my trusty Dell XPS and to record the audio I'm using my Zoom H2 handy recorder and then I'm going to piece it all together in Movie Maker. Here we go. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is you want to create all of your instruments in Reason and I've set up some of the standard instruments that I use a lot and so I set up a redrum, a subtractor for my bass, uh, Thor for some cool uh, pulsing synth kind of thing, an, NX an NXT for a piano, and the Maelstrom for a uh, pad, but you can set up whatever instruments you want. You know Reason's got a million of them in there and you love them all. Um, you can set them up as you go along. I just set them up all at beginning here for demonstration purposes. One other thing I started doing too that I want to mention is for for the instruments, especially for your bass and drums, you want to add one of these uh, one of these maximizers to each of them. It really ha helps fatten up the sound a lot, I think. Okay, so next thing you want to do, so once you got all your instruments set up, is set up a nice even uh, bar section here, like 8 or 16. And what you're basically going to do here is you're going to create your own loop patterns. And so you set up a nice 8 bar pattern, and then you set the loop on and off to on, of course, okay? Set your quantize on, set your click and your pre-count on to on as well. What that does is... Uh, the pre-count, it gives you a, a four counts before it starts recording, so you can hit the button and then get ready to go. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is record my drums, which sound like like that, some kind of basic hip-hop sounding kind of drums. Alright, so let's let this roll here and see what it sounds like. Itself, and then you can start to lay down all of your other uh, instruments and whatnot. Let me just add some hi hats here to my drums, make it sound a little better. Two, here we go. you want to do is you want to take off your click because now you got drums you don't need to click anymore so now you're going to lay down your bass or whatever instrument you want to do but for purposes here I'm just going to lay down my bass now you can do all this on the fly you don't have to stop recording here if you're good enough and you know exactly what you want to play uh, you can do it like that but I'm just going to kind of uh, stop each one maybe I'll maybe I'll get it a little uh, quicker as I go along in this demo so let's try my bass oops I didn't mean to do that here we go let's try that again make sure my Make sure my bass sound is all happening the way I want it to. All right, here we go. All right, so now I got my bass and my drums happening here. Now let's just go over to Thor here. What you can do is you can let it keep recording, but or let it keep looping, but turn it off to record, and then you can kind of practice. 